Well, you know, when we grew up, knowing how to tell time from an analog clock was pretty much a, a necessary survival skill. Well, now all we have to do is look at the digital clock on our phones, right? But the classic clock face isn't entirely out of style. LEX18's Austin Pollock introduces us to a man who makes sure we don't entirely lose track of time. Before, everything I did was in a one-car garage. A timeless craft, one tick at a time. I'm always looking at my watch, you know, I guess I got a bad thing about that. Keith Chambers prefers telling time in a more classic way. I guess time well kept, you know. No smartwatch or digital clock, just making sure the analog clock doesn't become a lost art. It was a hobby because I made stuff for my daughter, you know, then I got the big idea. I said I was going to make wooden gear clocks and I was going to sell them. Now living in Harrodsburg with almost endless space to work. Chambers used to live in Lexington. He watched companies downsize in the late 2000s. I got, I got laid off in 2011. They were down to 11 employees. At the time, family grew older. He took care of them, spent more hours, minutes, and seconds in his shop nearly around the clock, preparing for art shows near and far. Shaker Village, I've done it for like two years. Uh, a big show around this area is Woodland Art Fair. I like doing outdoor shows. Oh, the weather's been kind of hard to deal with lately, you know. Sometimes we just want to pause time right now, appreciate treasures Keith's father used in World War II, go back to less expensive times, a pandemic less world, more peace. Chambers says the show, however, must go on. Right now I'm doing about seven shows. Well, I like talking to the people who come in and want to buy something. I like selling stuff, you know. On the other hand, as far as what's to come, he knows only time will tell. Uh, going forward, I probably only do maybe three or four shows a year. I'll probably just wind down to nothing, you know. Yeah, I'll work out here till I drop, you know, as old saying go. In Mercer County, Austin Pollock, Evening Edition.